Hello friends, my name is Sala and you're watching Smart Code. So another JavaScript tutorial and in this tutorial you will learn how to change an image on click. For example, you see an image on the screen and as I click on the image, it is changed to the second one. So we will learn to perform this operation in JavaScript and then we will enhance this application. And in enhancement, we will make it work like image toggle. And image toggle means as you click on the second image, you will get back the first image. And when you click again on the first image, you will see the second one. So it's a toggle between the images, right? So let's now jump into the code and start the development. Now you see my code editor. And in order to code such application, you actually need two images. I have two images in my code editor, one.jpg and two.jpg. The size of the both the images is same, that is 400 into 250 pixels. So you can adjust the size of your images in advance or you can use CSS for that. When we write CSS, then I will show you how to make images of different sizes to the same size, right? So let's prepare some HTML. So our HTML part is done. We only need an image container and the image itself. The image element has an ID which we are going to use to select it in the JavaScript. And the first image, 1.jpg, is the default image. As we run the application, we will see that image in the browser, right? And as you can see, I have already linked the CSS and the JavaScript file to the HTML. So now we will code some CSS. In our universal selector, we will reset heading and margin and we set box sizing to the border box and so now I will target the image container and set a size to it the width of the container is 400 pixels and the height is 250 pixels right so after defining the size to the image container we will force the images to fit into that container so we would say width 100% and height would also be 100%, right? So that is a technique that you will use to resize your images according to the size of the container. I already have my images to that size, 400 pixels into 250 pixels. So you won't see any difference. But if you have images of different size, you will code like that. You will first define a size in terms of width and height to the container. And then you will force your images to fit into the container, right? And now finally, we will put the application to the center of the page using CSS Flex. That's it. Our CSS part is also done. And this is how it looks in the browser, right? And now the JavaScript. In the JavaScript, we will first select the image element, image tag. We need it in the JavaScript to listen for the click event, right? So select the image element first using the get element by ID method. So the images is the ID of the image element, right? So after selecting the image element, we will listen for the click event to it. So very simple JavaScript, we are listening for the click to the image element and whenever the click is performed, this anonymous JavaScript function is called. So when the click is performed and the function is called, we will simply change the image of the image element. So we will target the SRC attribute and we'll assign the second image to it. That's it, our application change image on click is ready. So we'll refresh the page and now make a click and here you see the second image, right? And now how to make it work like a toggle. I wanna see the first image again when I click on the second one. So we need to code a very simple logic to implement the toggle. Let's now take a toggle variable and set it to true. So this is a boolean variable which is set to true 
and this variable will toggle itself from true to false and false to true true to false and false to true right and when the value is true we will show the second image and in case when the value is false we will show the first image right so inside the function we will program the toggle like this and here you see the use of logical not logical not change the status from true to false and false to true so in the beginning the value inside the toggle variable is true but when you make a click the true changes to false right and when you make another click the false changes to true and it will continue to toggle itself between true and false as you make click right so now we need to code a simple if statement and we will say if the toggle is true then show the first image otherwise show the second image and we don't need this line of code right so now our application is done we have implemented the toggle so refresh the page and click on the image here you see the second one now click again the second image here you see the first one right so it's a very fine toggle between the images so that was a simple javascript tutorial and you learned how to program change image on click and then how to perform a toggle i will see you in some other tutorials and thanks for watching